Hi guys, I'm Lyria Gordon, a devotional author, and I am inviting you to walk in obedience as we live out Matthew chapter 4, verse 19 together. At the beginning of his ministry, Jesus demonstrated the importance of a team to accomplish his purpose. As a result, Jesus called men who were actively engaged in their profession to help him maximize and fulfill his God-assigned purpose. Matthew chapter 4, verses 18 to 22 reads, And Jesus, walking by the Sea of Galilee, saw two brothers, Simon called Peter, and Andrew his brother, casting a net into the sea, for they were fishermen. Then he said to them, Follow me and I will make you fishers of men. They immediately left their nets and followed him. Going from there, he saw two other brothers, James, the son of Zebedee, and John, his brother, in the, in the boat with Zebedee, their father, mending their nets. He called them, and immediately they left their boat and their father and followed him. Notice that these four men were busy. They were fishermen. Two were casting a net into the sea, and the other two were mending their nets with their father. But they immediately left everything behind without having a detailed plan from Jesus and followed him. When Jesus said to Simon Peter and Andrew in verse 19, follow me and I will make you fishers of men, What was he really asking of them? Jesus wasn't just asking them to change their profession. He was calling them to a life of purpose and service, a life dedicated to spreading his message of the kingdom of heaven, love, and salvation. In that simple yet powerful call, Jesus was inviting Simon, Peter, Andrew, James, and John, and us to be his disciples, to walk in his footsteps, to share his teachings with everyone we encounter. This call is not just for Jesus' original disciples and a selected few, but for each of us. Jesus mandated all of us with the Great Commission in Matthew chapter 28, verse 19, to go and make disciples of all nations. Are you willing to obey Jesus' call and step in faith as fishers of men? A fisher of men means being a beacon of light in a world surrounded in darkness. It means embodying the love, compassion, and forgiveness that Jesus exemplified during his time on earth. Living out Matthew chapter four, verse 19 means actively seeking to share the good news of Jesus with everyone. Will you be a light in a world filled with darkness, shining brightly with the truth of the gospel? Let us strive to walk in obedience each day, following the example set by Peter, Andrew, James, and John. Let us embrace the calling of Matthew chapter 4, verse 19, with courage, determination, and unwavering faith. May our lives be a testament to the power of obedience as we follow Jesus.